the sort of trick with doing science is to sort of identify you know, a question that intrigues you and basically identify sort of a gap in our knowledge and then come up with a, a way of, of trying to answer that question. My name is Charlie Rice and I head the Laboratory of Virology and Infectious Disease. Our favorite virus over the last 25 years has been hepatitis C virus. And it's a virus that affects uh, about 170 million people around the world. Anything that uh, you're interested in, if you probe deep enough, you find out you know, how ignorant you really are and how much there is to still learn. And uh, that's, that's true of, of, of viruses and biology in general. And so it's actually been quite a remarkable period of time going from a virus that was basically a mystery and sort of back in the late 70s and, and 1980s to today where we actually have a, an oral, well-tolerated cure for this virus that can cure more than 95% of the people that are treated in three months of treatment. And that's a change from uh, sort of the beginning where we had much more toxic therapies that could cure only about 5% of the people. So it's really been quite an interesting endeavor, both from a, a basic science standpoint, but also something that's contributed to sort of major sort of medical advances. In our lab, I think that the students and the postdocs have a great deal of freedom to sort of pursue uh, what interests them. That's actually, I think, uh, sort of one of the, the great things about uh, sort of Rockefeller and, and doing science here. You really never know where the sort of transformative discoveries are going to be coming from. And so it's very important to encourage people that have the sort of curiosity and drive to pursue that. To, to fund and pursue curiosity-driven research, even if you can't necessarily see an immediate sort of benefit for doing that. Because often some of the great breakthroughs, I think, in biomedical discovery, research, and application come from things that are completely unexpected just by a curious mind given the resources to pursue that uh, curiosity. 